you guys. I'm about to make some tea. I just lit the grill. See the fire? But I don't know how to light a grill. Anyway, I'm about to give me some sour leaf to make some tea. <clears throat> and enjoy my morning in this beautiful place. Rustic Mountain Living. That's why I am in Jamaica. Hanover, Jamaica. Rustic Mountain Living with Barefoot Lady. Listen, I'm having the best time. And this has been the best birthday ever. So now I'm going to go pick some sour sap leaf to make some sour sap tea. And enjoy my morning. Look at this, guys. What else can you ask for? All right, so let me go get some sour stuff. Please. So for those of you who don't know, this is a sour sap tree. All right, this is what the leaves look like. And they got some fruits bearing on it right now. This ain't ready yet. This is still hard, it's gonna need some more time. We got a little baby one right here. Yeah. So I'm just gonna pick me a few leaves to make some tea. Some smaller ones. Mm. I got a bunch of leaves. I'm going to make some for tea. I ain't going to use all of this. And then I'm going to take some home with me. I'm going to come back and pick some more. But got some sap sap leaves, you guys. All right, I'm going to make some tea now. All right, you guys. So when it comes to making sour sap tea, I like mine strong, so I use two to three leaves per cup. So if you want yours strong, use two to three leaves. If you want yours less strong, maybe use one and a half to two leaves. Add it to your cup and add some boiling hot water and steep for five to ten minutes depending on how strong you want. Then add sweetener of your choice if you choose and enjoy. Now I'm off to the market. <laughs> 